Delicious and nutritious. Welcome back to 42 for 42. That delicious smoothie that I was just enjoying. Just uh, organic grapes, strawberries, peach, and pineapple, frozen, mixed with some water in the Nutribullet. Zip, zip, zip. Awesome. Running today felt great. Not sure why today of all days it was great, but it was great today. I felt good and strong. Up until the very end, it felt really good. Mind you, I was going pretty slow. I was only going about six minutes per kilometer, which is pretty slow. Um, but still, it felt good. I felt good running today, which is the first time since I started up again that it felt good. Every other time it's been, ugh, I'm running, ugh. But today felt good, so I'm happy about that. I haven't been quite on my schedule for running yet, but I've still been getting out there getting the kilometers in, getting a start on it, taking it nice and slow, ramping it up nice and easy. Um, just five kilometers today, took a half hour to do it. Nice, smooth, easy pace, but for the first 25 minutes of that, it felt great. Push-ups hit a snag. On Tuesday, something happened to my back. I'm assuming that it's uh, from doing all the push-ups and not hydrating enough pulled a muscle, it got cramped up, whatever happened, but man was it painful. Wednesday woke up, couldn't move, couldn't do anything. So Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, no push-ups. Not looking good for the 2000 mark for this month. Next month for sure, 2000 push-ups. Because of the chafing issue with the sit-ups, I'm just looking at a thousand sit-ups for next month. Make that a more reasonable goal. We'll just see how it goes. Maybe I'll develop a good sit up callus, I don't know. Diet wise, not eating any junk food. Haven't been buying anything to bring into the house. We did go out for a special dinner last Friday. Went to a local brew house pub and we consumed many beers and ate their truffles and their really rich and delicious food. It was awesome, it was a great experience. Cooking more again, making healthy, delicious meals, uh, eating pasta, but to me that's okay especially when I just make it with onions and kale and spinach and a little bit of pesto sauce and toss the noodles in and that's it. That's the meal. Works for me. I have lost one and a half pounds again this week and still just making really small changes, not jumping into things too quickly because I don't want to be discouraged and I want to be able to continue. And so far, I don't feel deprived at all. I'm feeling great. Getting all the exercise in is a tiny bit challenging, but it's not too much. Just making, wrapping it up nice and small. Note to family, if we're having a family function and we're all getting together, if you're sick, let's postpone the family function. I had my parents over, well, my whole family over for my dad's birthday party, but my dad was miserably sick. And I can tell that he didn't want to be here, so mom, you shouldn't have made him come over. He didn't get to enjoy his meal and he definitely didn't get to enjoy the night. So in the future, let's postpone that because now my wife's really sick. <laughs> and I think that I was sick throughout the week because I felt dog tired and exhausted all week. And so next time if that happens again, let's just postpone. We can just postpone. We don't have to get each other sick. We don't have to share the germs. Next time, we'll just postpone. I've got a new mission now to go along with this vlog in conjunction with. I'm trying to get my YouTube friend, Shea Carl, well, I consider him a friend because I watch him and his family every day on YouTube, but he has no idea who I am, so <laughs> he's my friend, but I'm not his friend yet. Uh, I'm trying to get Shea Carl to Victoria to run my first marathon with me. Hashtag Shea Carl Victoria Marathon. And you can uh, tweet me, I just got a tweet, a tweeter, catching up with the, the tweeting and the twitting and the being a twit. And that's at Marcus Roberts with a zero instead of the O, because Marcus Roberts, of course, was already taken. If you've been liking the vlog series, which I hope you have, please make sure that you give me a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel. Subscribe to my channel. Subscribe!
and don't forget to share. The more views I get, the more thumbs up I get, the more support I get, the more encouraged I'll be. So please share my videos. Please share my channel. Please thumbs up. Please subscribe. Please and thank you very much. And I'd love to hear what you're thinking of the, the vlog series. What you'd like to see, what you don't like seeing. If you like me or you don't like me. I just want to see some comments and see some support. And also see what you're doing. Are you making any changes? Keep watching. Keep giving me your support. And I will see you next week. A little change at a time. A little change at a time.